Hi everyone, in this video I will talk about punctuation. Four crucial punctuations covered on SAT writing section, which means you can come across questions about commas, colons, semicolons and dashes. And here we have two straightforward rules uh, that cover all punctuation. Uh, first is what? Never use uh, any punctuation before that and prepositional phrases with at, in, with, of, for, on, to. And here uh, we have just two following examples. Uh, she said that she was confused. There is no punctuation before that. And he put his mother on the diet. There is no any punctuation before on. And the second rule is what? Uh, never use any punctuation after such as, including like. And we have here an uh, example. He knows two languages, including Russian, English, and French. As you see, there is no punctuation after including. And now I like specifically talk about commas. When we use commas, when there is a break or pause in a sentence, we use uh, commas. So we have here four categories, as you see. <clears throat> the first one is what? Uh, dependent, independent clause. Uh, what does this mean? In order to separate like dependent or just we call this phrase from complete sentence, we use commas. Uh, for example, we have your uh, sentence, if you don't study hard, you will fail. As you see that in order to separate this part from the complete part, we need just, uh, we must put just comma. And uh, the second one is what? Fanboys, which is here each uh, capital letter uh, refers to a conjunction, like for, and, neither, but, or, yet, so. You can see them on the right side. Uh, I mean, what does the fanboys mean? Uh, keep in your mind that you cannot put a single comma between two complete sentence or two independent sentence. In order to connect them, you must use this uh, conjunctions, just, uh, which just refers, as I said, like the uh, capital letters. For example, it was still painful, uh, so I went to see the doctor like uh, you see I mean two complete sentence like uh, are connected uh, with this uh, conjunction so and before them we just put uh, what uh, comma and the third one is what extra or parenthetical phrase so I would like to see you like pay just more attention uh, to these two examples because uh, uh, there is a subtle difference between them. So, uh, first is what? The boy who lives in neighborhood likes to sing songs. Actually, it seems like uh, extra, like parenthetical phrase, but uh, it's not. And look at the second one. Tommy, one of her lovely students, gave her a gift. Like, uh, but here, just this part, one of her lovely students is just what? Parenthetical phrase. And how can we just... Uh, understand that it's extra or not. If it's not extra, by the way, you don't need just, I mean, you must, uh, you, you mustn't just put commas. So, uh, I just like, I'd like just to recommend you just uh, one uh, single message, like, you can uh, remove it, I mean, by yourself. If just you remove this, uh, I mean, the, 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 that part, if the structure of the sentence uh, is preserves, like, it, which means that it makes sense, then it is uh, like not a parenthetical phrase and you don't have to put like commas there. But when just you remove this part and if the meaning of the sentence uh, doesn't change, it means that it's a parenthetical phrase and you uh, have to put just commas. As you see that, for example, I can read the sentence, the second one like this, Tom, uh, Tommy gave her a gift. like. Uh, here just uh, I can understand the sentence without this phrase but in first one the boy likes to sing songs which is this part who lives in neighborhood clarifies identifies that boy that's why this is gonna be the essential part of the sentence and I don't need just to put commas here and the last one is just list in order to, to separate the items we use uh, like commas here we have example his favorite subjects include math physics and chemistry as you see that we just separate the items by using commas. Like. And in the end, uh, I'd like to say that if you like this video, do not uh, forget to subscribe our YouTube channel in order to not miss our future uh, videos. Thanks for watching. See you soon.